visits to this event that's like chief maybe I don't get sense he came to me on a very short notice but because of the special love that the people of our Africa, the Africa people have shown to me, have shown to my government, it is important that at this particular moment, I also show support to them. Let me, on behalf of the government and the wonderful people, peace loving people, of the United States, condone with you, like I've said before, monarchs don't die, they transit to become ancestors. But unfortunately, governors don't be ancestors. So I know when I leave the office, I'll try to be a manager, I'll try to be an ancestor later. <laughs> But let me say that uh, we are happy to support you because it is our duty to support our own and you are our own. I won't make much speech today because I'll be here in a couple of uh, days or when I will come for the transition of the Amaya War of Africa. So I will reserve my speech. Maybe other things I would like to say for that event. But I will not leave here without making because you people happy. I'm aware that your school has been recognized, but has not been given the official backing. Let me assure you that from next week, the process of gazetting of your school will be completed and made public. I am expecting a special invitation 
from my good man, the Amaiba of Okwesi. Last day, let us also come there. That's valid for you. So I come and make merry with you. And also make important pronouncements. Let me also say this. We must abide by the tenet of peace. That is the only way we can bring that desired development that we are all yearning for, for the people of River States. So I want to urge every one of you, please ensure that we maintain peace so that the promises we made during our campaign will be fulfilled to everybody in our diaspora. Let me thank you once again for your support. In fact, when my motorcade was barricaded, I thought people were sent to come and attack me. But when I saw the support, the excitement in the faces of the youth and even elderly men who had to block the way to receive me, it gives me so much joy. Knowing fully well that this journey, I am not alone in it. I am in it with people who believe and understand our dream and aspiration for our states. So let me thank you again. I will not take this love for granted. There are a lot of things that we are supposed to do for you. We will come and do it for you people. We will come and do it for you people. Let me thank every one of you. More especially the traditional rulers. I have to commend you for your peaceful nature in this kingdom. Please, keep it up. I don't know how you do it. Let's continue to do it because it's important for us to live in peace. On this note, I thank every one of you that have come to support the community family on this very great event. God will grant you very mercy. And everybody who have cause to celebrate at the appropriate time. Thank you. And may God bless every one of you. Thank you, Excellency. Your Excellency, we thank you for your laudable pronouncements.